this is just my issue. I know on a second date, I I I might have had sex with uh, you know probably my most significant you know relationship, right? I I think girls just have this this thing that oh my goodness, I gotta hold this, I gotta hold this because he's not gonna respect me or what have you. It comes down to what type of guy you're you're you're, you're courting here, and. I don't know that. You see, give me, give me something, man. You're giving, you're just going around so Tell me, give me something, man. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to go out. Marcus, Marcus, jumping. He's just itching to get in here. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> if you want a guy to consider you a keeper, can I use the F word? Please? Oh yes. Oh, oh, we'll beep it out. We'll beep it out. Don't have sex with him. Not the first week. Not the second week. I don't, I don't Not the third that. week. I don't agree with give that. Give it at least a minimum, a month. I don't if you give it up to him too quick, I respect I that you don't agree. But I'm telling you, there's a reason. If you give it up too quick, what happens to the guy? You want to talk about male ego and male... Uh, have, when a male has it and the challenge is done and the chase is finished, then he's just going to use you for sex. Because it's comfortable. You've given it up. Now what else is left? Your personality after that? Uh-uh. Your personality has to be the chase. Your ambitions have to be the chase. Okay, the things that make you genuine, the things that make you special as a woman, those are the things that you have to hold on to for as long as you can, only with the guy that you consider to be potentially a keeper. If you don't consider him a keeper, and you think it's just somebody that you're super attracted to, your vagina's pulsing, throbbing, you're so attracted to this guy, do whatever you gotta do as soon as you can. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 we don't, no, 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 Monday morning, well, Sunday morning, we spent the entire Sunday morning talking about this. But, okay. anyway, but anyway, I agree with Marcos here. Do not give it up, because I've known guys, now let me ask you a question, Avi. Yeah. You meet a girl, she gives it up the first night to you, okay, you can take her home next week to meet your mom. Uh, I think that's also a loaded question, but no, no well, the answer is no, no, yeah, no. Okay. but I just want to, I just want to say one thing, add something, I think for girls it should be natural, I think if a guy is being too pushy, and if a guy is trying to really get it in, then you know he's trying to get it in, but I think if the time is right, yeah. there's no actual time, time frame. frame, you don't exactly. have to add one week, two weeks, three weeks, exactly. if, if you guys are at the same place in the same moment, at the same time, and you feel like it's the natural, you know, occurrence of events, then go for Pastor it. Curve is the best. It, mm -hmm. Sean, go ahead. What do you um, think, sir? I don't know, like, as, as I heard you guys, you know, talking about uh, those particular scenarios, I thought of a, another scenario of, uh, I'm not entirely sure if this individual will be watching this video, and <laughs> if you are, you might know who it is that you are, but for everybody else, I'm not using names. But essentially, initials? No, no, no initials either. Um, essentially, there was this guy that wanted this girl, right? The girl was my friend. And this guy said everything in the book to get this girl. Now this girl was just thinking that, you know, this guy was, you know, a great guy and whatever, but because she was so emotionally invested, I couldn't have just been like, well, yeah, you know, he is, you know, trying these things. So I hinted at a lot of these things. She was just so emotionally invested and it was difficult to, you know, just really let her see that this guy's playing you. Anyway, so the guy played the full gamut. Like I'm talking about like this was not even, you know, one month, two yeah. this guy this guy played it. So maybe after, you know, five, six months or whatever it is, um, you know, I, I get word, hey, you know, uh, we're engaged. And, you know, right. before we know it, they're married. Because her ideal was, I won't have sex with you until I'm married to you. So this guy played the entire gamut. Now he's married to her, has sex with her, and, you know, give it nine months later, they're, they're divorced. Now, this, we, go, now, now hang on, hang on. There's a lot of, no, hang on, hang on. I'm, I'm going to defend this right now. There's a lot of people out there who are going to say, well, she should have given him early. Now, she, now, how do you think she handled it right? She just misjudged the character of the guy, though. Yeah, right? I, th I think she definitely misjudged. She did right. She just misjudged the character. Well, but, but what I'm but, saying, though, is that you can't necessarily... Um, it's not a time frame. Yeah, there's no time frame, number time one. Frame, yeah. And it's very difficult for somebody to actually... Um, I guess see beyond what it is that that person is projecting at that particular time. So he was showing all, all the green lights, so to speak. But I guess because I'm a guy, I could kind of see those yeah, red lights red flashing. Flag. I'm going to add to what uh, Deshaun is saying. I mean, I've, I've heard experiences exactly similar to that, where guys have, you know, kind of, they, 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 they know that um, there's, a, there's a silver lining after the rainbow. So they're, 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 they're they're just pushing. They're well, not not pushing, but they're they got all the stops out. They, you know, they, they they make it so rosy. Mm -hmm. Then they get married. Then they get married, and now the, the woman is like, I was treated so well earlier on in the relationship. Where is that? And then she gets upset. Then 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 this back and forth 
tension happens. Mm -hmm. And I've seen that. I've seen that. Uh, just, I just want to add one thing though, but I think it's really the answer is a, a combination of what we've all said because at the same time there is no time frame, but there's a lot of people who are in, inexperienced and a lot of women who feel insecure and are feeling like, well, what time, like the pressure of the question is what time should I give it up because I don't know if you'll like me for who I am, but exactly like what you said, you know, you have to be confident and, and value who you are and respect who you are before you can make a decision of when should I give it up and stuff like that. Okay, now here's one right now. I believe ladies, and you know, it's up to you guys, but I know too many cases where she has given it up. I ask her a couple weeks later, how's the relationship going? And she says, we're no longer going out. And I ask her, how long after he broke up with you did you have sex? She goes, hmm, maybe about a week prior to that. So like I'm with Marcos over here. I believe if he's going to like you and stick around, he's going to like you for what you have inside your personality. Because let me tell you something, if you give it up too soon, either or, guy, don't give it up. The longer you hold off for it, the longer that relationship's going to go. But in that, in that scenario, the girl is kind of saved because the girl hasn't invested a lot of time in that, that, that guy who's really not going to stick around. So it, it, it adds to that, it's, it's better for them. Au contraire, okay. though, because in today's digital age, we are completely blasted with instant communication. So you would think that because a lot of time hasn't passed that we haven't devoted too much attention, but really because we have instant access to communication at all times. We're actually devoting so much thought power, so much emotional sensitivity to what we're putting into the communicational aspect that we are devoting a lot of attention to something so small. And that's why things heat up so quickly because we have such access to communicate. You start sexting real quick, real quick. Okay, images start getting flown through text messages real quick. Instagram, f name it, whatever social media I use. This stuff is happening fast. The way that I use the time scale was only based on, on, on an ideology that if you're looking at a man that, 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 that you think this man is somebody I would like to introduce to my mother mm -hmm. or my father, mm -hmm. then it should be respected in a time gap as it was in the old school days. And one month isn't even that much in the old school days. That's right? it. That's it. So that's the only reason. There is no time frame. I agree with all of you, mm. right? But in, in, in the sense of today's day and age, I think that if you do give it a month, see which guy sticks around after a month. That's it. There's your challenge. And then his, it's it. And if he likes you and he cares about you and he wants to take you home, he's going to wait. He will wait. There's, just, there's more important things than sex. Right. Absolutely. There's so many.